Repost, OOP's younger sister tries to seduce her husband. I am not op. Original post by you, throw Ray T 8228 in our, relationship advice. This was previously posted here over 7 months ago. An NBSP. My 10 years younger sister is trying to seduce my husband and I'm freaking out. The 2nd of May 22. My. 30F. Sister. 20F. Has started college in the city my husband. 28 meters. And I live in. There's a housing shortage here and getting your own place may take 23 years sometimes. So she moved in with us. We live in a four bedroom apartment. She moved in last week in November. Everything was great at first later I started noticing that she's very affectionate with my husband. When he works from home. She is home that day. Making him sandwiches, coffee etc. She never uses the shower in her room because it's too small. Instead she uses bigger one in the hall so she can walk around in a towel. Sometimes going into the kitchen to make tea when my husband is tidying up after dinner. She stands there in the towel chit-chatting. It feels so weird and perverted tbh I mean she's my baby sister. I thought maybe I'm overreacting because I seem to be the only one noticing anything weird. I have spoken to my mom about it but she says it's in my head because my husband loves me and my sister loves me and I'm just feeling insecure because I'm pregnant and have gained weight. I'm having a difficult pregnancy. So yesterday I took a day of and stayed in bed. My husband was working from home. My sister didn't know I was home. She came home from the gym and she had bought lunch with her. She called for my husband to join her and I heard her loudly saying I bet you wish you had a wife. Who took care if you like this? I went to the kitchen and she was in her sport bra and very small tight shorts. She was like oh I didn't know you're here and she took her lunch and went to her room. I don't know what to do about this situation. I have mentioned this once to her about her walking around in a towel but she laughed it off saying that I was imagining things because I'm insecure. If I kicked her out it would mean that she can't continue with her studies this year because my parents live 5 hours away. I'm not worried about my husband but I think what she's doing is disrespectful and for it to continue one maybe two years is honestly exhausting. WTF is wrong with her. She used to be my baby girl. An NBSP. Update, I kicked out my little sister out of my home because she's been trying to seduce my husband. The 2nd of August 22. Since my mother and sister dismissed me I talked to my husband. Thank you for suggesting that. He told me that he has noticed my sister acting weird around him. He was however very uncomfortable talking to me about it. Since it was my idea that she should live with us. I might think he's making things up to kick my sister out. He said the days he's been working from home. She's been almost always home. Walking around in her underwear or tiny gym wearing. He asked her on a number of occasions to put some more clothes on. She laughed and asked if he's not used to being around confident women. She also always talked me down in front of him and commented things like, my bad posture, or, my old age, or, I wonder if she will be able to lose her baby weight. I was appalled. WTF is wrong with my sister. I have never had problems with her and I always took care of her growing up. I decided that she must leave. I have been trying to find a place for her in the city and I know one of my colleague's grandmother rents rooms for students. She lives near campus so it would be perfect for her. I didn't want to break the news myself to her because by now I know what she would say. That I am so jealous and threatened by her. So I asked my husband to talk to her. Apparently she broke down crying. Asking him if I put him up to this. He told her that this was his apartment as much as it's mine and he's not comfortable having her. Around. He told her about the new arrangement we've made but if she didn't like it she was welcome to find a place on her own or move back home. She's getting until the end of the month.
Today she was so angry with me. She told me that if my husband really loved me I wouldn't have felt so threatened by her. She was also mad because now she'll have to pay rent and live in a smaller room. I don't know. I feel sorry for her. But I'm honestly shocked at how callous she is. When did this happen? Only yesterday she was my baby who waited for me to come home on holidays to try my new clothes and make up. Now she's shut in her room. Only speaking to me to call me pathetic and insecure. I'm so miserable right now. An NBSP. Reminder I am not the original poster. Who needs enemies when you have family willing to manipulate and insult you daily? What else did OOP's little sister expect? With the escalation, it was either this or an affair that would end in her getting kicked out anyways after making oop. Miserable. The sister is a weirdo. Why do these would-be interlopers always blame the spouse for being insecure when they get called out and rejected? Is it really that hard for them to believe maybe the person they're going after doesn't want them? What was the sister's plan here? To steal OP's husband and there would be no consequences for that? Only yesterday she was my baby who waited for me to come home on holidays to try my new clothes and make up. Sounds like that's still what she thinks she is doing. Little sister needs to figure out who she is so she can stop this toxic behavior towards her big sister. A husband is not a new sweater to try on. Oop low-key sounds like she was parentified and expected to raise care for her younger sister way. Beyond what's normal, mom is dismissive. Sister walks all over her and violates boundaries left and right. Dad is apparently not present or not active in the family. And Oop defaulted to, how do I take care of this, instead of talking to her partner. As if the idea that someone else would help her is a foreign idea. I'm wondering if the sister is a GC or something. Because no healthy family dynamic would have led to this kind of behavior. Only yesterday she was my baby who waited for me to come home on holidays to try my new clothes and make up. How they grow up so fast first they want to try on her older sister's clothes. Then they want try on her older sister's husband. What was the long-term goal of the little sister here? To become a mistress to the type of dude who would cheat on his pregnant wife with her sister. I know she's 20. But did she think a second of this through? Op did the right thing by kicking her out. Her sister was SXU ally harassing her husband. As well as disrespecting her in her own home. Honestly I'd go no contact after that. I'm sure this will have been picked up in the comments of the original. But the line about little sis waiting to see Op so she can use her clothes and makeup. That's telling. Seems to me little sis thinks she is owed anything of ops. Including her husband. If I was giving one of my younger siblings a free place to live and they called me pathetic and jealous they'd be yeeted out the door in the next five minutes. Ops sisters is a little piece of work but op also needs to do some older sister work here and put her firmly in her place. Poor oop. Baby sister is so jealous of her. Sometimes people forget that babies grow up and become adults capable of being bad people. Regardless of whatever nostalgic memories you have about them as a kid. This woman is still not getting the real magnitude of what her sister was doing. She's fixated on the little person she used to be. Families of murderers. Rapists. Pedophiles kidnappers etc all remember them as sweet innocent kids at some point but it doesn't change who they grew to become op's sister should have been paying something to be in the apartment in the first place it's part of being a responsible adult second a baby is on the way household dynamics would truly change then
and being a college kid that's a detriment to studying in young adult life. The younger sister is already showing poor judgment and boundary issues. But trying to seduce the brother-in-law? That's messed up. Seriously. What's wrong with the sister? She has a whole campus full of people to meet and develop relationships with. Does little sis hate big sis or does little sis have more issues than that? Imagine all the free rent if she just didn't try to seduce her sister's husband. Poor op. The sad thing is. She doesn't see that this is just a continuation though little sis behavior when she was young. Lil sis used to love dressing up as her. Now she expects to be able to have her husband too. Sue this doesn't actually seem like it's about the husband. It sounds like the younger one is jealous of the older one and probably has been for longer than. She's noticed. Maybe Op was being treated like a babysitter, extra parent growing up? She sees her little sister as a kid still and little sister is out here ready to prove she's a woman. Bet she doesn't want the husband. She wants the husband to want her. She told me that if my husband really loved me I wouldn't have felt so threatened by her. I feel if I was op I would have responded. In not threatened I'm insulted. My husband is the one who feels threatened. How would you feel if you were happily with someone and some creepy guy you have no interest in? Decided to hang out in his boxers constantly saying stuff like, you like what you see, and every time you tell him no he smirks and acts like he's some god's gift to women and thinks you're just shy and keeps insisting you will fall for him. It's gross sis and you will not convince me. Or my husband that it's different. He agrees it's the same too. He's creeped out and uncomfortable but I know you're so full of yourself and date all sorts of loser guys that would leave someone for a pair of legs that you think we're all lying about it. Some people are so manipulative they'll bite the hand that feeds them just to one-up someone. I would like to think the younger sister learned something from this. But I doubt it. If you enjoyed this video. Please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.